Oh, hey, man. Hey, What's dude. What's going on? Uh, not much. Just making some fighter wine, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to another vlog. We're here at Seaweed Pacific Air Terminal. Air Terminal? What? <laughs> I don't know, you just picked up the camera and started filming Kyle. Thank you. Sorry, thank you. Yes! So this is this is first step. So all the new and used bottles go through this process of where it's basically disinfected. So it's called the acidifier. They use acid to clean the bottles. step-by-step -step process. So it goes through the acidifier first, which basically disinfects the bottle, and then it goes through here, which is the, the bottle washer. Caustic soda. It's clean with caustic soda. Never heard that before. So then it goes through this process, which then goes down to here, where the inspectors inspect it. Inspectors are just looking for any impurities in the bottles before it goes through the next process. Um, any cracks, deformations. It's so loud in here, all the bottles clanking and clinging, but oh my god. So, this is where the bottles obviously get filled up with fighter wire. <laughs> Out the production date on the box. Sometimes. 
going to be doing a lot of this today, but I think it's kind of one of those things when in Rome for, for my approval. So I'm pace testing right now. Oh, so good. Honestly, it's probably one of my favorite alcohols to drink. Even though I don't drink that often, it's one of my favorites. Approve! 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 Final step. Backed up, boxed up, skipped everywhere around the Philippines. So this, this is not the final form, obviously, because you can tell it's a different color. But it still has to go through how many more processing steps? One, two more? One more. So this is the pre-final step fighter wire. Look at it, it looks, it looks like medicine, basically. It's, yeah, it, it, in its purest form, it's, it's fighter wine in its purest form. So, is it okay if I try it? It, it smells like... It smells like... More like cinnamon. Oh, it smells so good. I wish you guys would smell it. So this is 70 proof, and then the final product is 35 proof. Give it a go. Oh my goodness. It's really good though. So the batches are actually made in these smaller cylinders. And then it goes from here, added to the big ones, as one, and then one gets added, another gets added. I'm sweating, I'm sweating, I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Now we're talking, baby, now we're talking. Just making some fighter wine, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually really interesting. Like, yeah. I didn't think it's just so unique to see a factory system. Like, and to prove people that this isn't backyard made, this is a proper, well cleaned yeah. facility that fighter wine is produced in. I agree. It's so you cool. only went up there and tried, right? Dude, it's so. Do you want to try it? Yeah, straight up fighter wine. Uh -huh. Oh, it smells so neat. Dude, it's delicious. Well, what is it? It's just the herbs. So it's like the it's the last step before it turns into fighter wine. So this is what it looks like. I can just drink it? Oh. Dude, it's so good. Okay. It's really good. Kuyabao. Kulas. The original herbal fighter wine before it turns red and into the super fighter wine. I got a herb in my tongue. That's a star anise seed. I thought... Star anise seed, you buy That's a star, star anise seed? It's good, right? Yeah, it smells delicious. Yeah. It smells like something I want to... It's like... It's very homo... It smells cinnamony. Wilson! Woo! Wilson! He's got the shot glasses! Nice one, Wilson! Thank you, Mr. Wilson! Thank you, Wilson's the man, man. Wilson! The driver! The shot giver, glass giver. You guys, we're here at the Fighter Wine Factory. I know I already showed you the factory, but now we're gonna go to the chem lab. Chem lab? 
kind of kind of I'm a little bit I'm a little tipsy. I'm not gonna lie. We're here at the laboratory with the scientist or the chemist, as you can. Oh. Wilson, my man. How are you? Okay. Good. All right. Cool. These are the chemists. You guys said hi to my vlog. This, these are the chemists. Hello, chemists. Yeah. <laughs> Would you guys consider this a laboratory? Laboratory? Yes. This is their lab? You guys have the best job ever. They get a freaking company here, play with ingredients, and make alcohol. That's pretty awesome. So what we're going to do, what we're uh, you know, fortunate enough to be able to do, is come in here, and we're going to make our own alcohol. Let's make some alcohol. I'm sweating, man. I'm, I'm tipsy. I'm tipsy. <laughs> it's science. I love the math that they're doing the numbers. They're just like, woo, done. What's going through your mind right now, Bet? What are you, what are you doing? I'm just excited to make the most delicious alcohol you are ever going to taste. Do you think Fighter Wine's going to buy your mix and sell it and it's going to become world famous? And you're, you can be optimistic. I'm optimistic. You're optimistic. We're, we're optimistic here. Optimism house. Welcome. Wait, you yours is oak infused? Yeah, because it has like yeah. a vanilla... Yeah. Well, you really are a pro at this stuff, I, just, I, I, I was gonna say I pay attention. I don't really pay attention, but if it comes to something I'm interested in, I pay attention. Okay. Are you, are you Hobo? Do you actually have a plan though? You yes. really, do you believe he's going to make a good one? Well, I. I think so. Oh, they believe in you, Brett. Get out of here, man. But we're still adding water, right? Do you think they just make excuses? Dude, she just drinks. That's all you do all day. They don't even chemist. It's a lie. They just drink, man. Did you taste yours first? Yeah, you did. Right? Yeah, I did, man. I said it tasted healthy. It's a little too strong, but it's pretty good. Yeah. Okay, here. If you're Erwin Yusuf right now and you're watching this, you're like, oh, I mix cocktails, look at me. <laughs> like, good luck, Erwin. We got the science behind it. What is up? Still too strong. Yeah. Add more water. You know, can you guess the flavors? I mean, I guessed. It tastes like a salty caramel thing. <laughs> no, it's different. Wait, no. It's just a little bit syrupy. Yeah. Too much caramel? Too much banana. But I can't taste banana. banana. You have too, too, much much too much banana. banana. No way! Yeah. I wanted it to be banana. But it doesn't you know taste like banana. You know what happens though? What? Every time you drink it, it tastes. You go bananas. That's it here at the Fighter Factory. Today was awesome. It was still a little tipsy, but that's okay. We're gonna go enjoy a nice dinner and uh and I miss you. <clears throat> and I need you. I don't know if those lyrics were right. If I could mix into things, this is awkward. <laughs> Please don't put this in. <laughs>